are living organisms that grow in earth having stem, leaves and roots. Some plants prepare their own food in the process of photosynthesis. Plants also provide us oxygen. All living organisms use this oxygen to live. Now plants are divided into two types on the basis of where they grow. First one is terrestrial plants and the second one is aquatic plants. What is the main difference between terrestrial plants and aquatic plants? Let's discuss each in detail. Terrestrial plants. Terrestrial plants grow only on land. It's mean if you look at the terrestrial plants such as shrubs, mango trees, so they grow only on land. The roots of terrestrial plants are under the ground. It means we can't see the roots of terrestrial plants. So they help them, the roots of terrestrial plants help them to stable in the soil. And some terrestrial plants are small and some are big in the size. For example, shrub. So shrub are small in the size. While mango tree is big in the size. Students, can we at least one example of terrestrial plants? Shrubs. Shrubs is the common example of terrestrial plants. Let's come to the another type, type which is aquatic plants. Aquatic plants is the types of plants which grows in water. It's mean which grow, reproduce, find the food, survive, etc. So simply that aquatic plants grow in water. The roots of aquatic plants are hang. It means it holds tightly in the water, which is able to move. And the aquatic plants' roots are under the water. And aquatic plants have sponge leaves, which allow them to float on water. Float means which move on the surface of water without sinking. Common example of aquatic plant which is lotus. Lotus is the common example of aquatic plants. Stones, this was all about the difference between terrestrial plants and aquatic plants. Thanks for watching.